Don't come off the teammates like fucking bitch. Shut the f. You finna be going right where they're going. Bro, stay the bed. You finna go stay the bed with them. Shut the f. What the f? Yo, dude, dog. How do I feel like you, my Yeah. Whee! I'm talking to you, bro. It's supposed to be a moment. This supposed to be a moment. This supposed to be a moment. What good is being the one when you the only one that knows it? Hey man, it's the ISO guy sensei, the greatest 2K player in existence, man. And look, we got some new NBA 2K22 news, some graphic comparisons. And, um, and, a, and a 2K developer telling us a little bit about 2K and a few other things that popped out. And we're going to go over them, you know, first reaction type shit. Before we get into that, make sure you subscribe if you are new. Help me hit 300K, my nigga. It's free. Make sure you hit that like button, man. Helps the vids get pushed and turn on them post notice, man. We're going to be posting all the best builds, jump shots, news, patch news. Hilarious gameplays, all that in 2K22, man. So you gonna want to be in tune with the channel. But let's see what this guy gotta say, man. To all of our NBA 2K fans here in Japan, I am Eric Benish, executive producer for NBA 2K22. Okay. okay. I want to thank all of you for taking time uh, out of your schedules today to be here to give us a chance to tell you all about NBA 2K22. All the tell it, tell it, tell me something. Uh, I'm sorry I'm not able to be there in person today. Uh, that's fine. Uh, this is an event I've been at many, many, many times before, okay. so I'm going to miss seeing all of you today. Uh, but maybe okay. in the future we can uh, correct that, and I'll be there to do this in person. Okay. <laughs> okay, T tell me something. Uh, but today we have a lot of great things to talk about. Okay. But I want to start off by congratulating uh, Mr. Rui Hachimura for no, no, we being on the we cover don't, of the We don't give a fuck. Uh, that's a we don't give a fuck. to have him. We don't and give a we fuck. we are very proud of him, so Rui, uh, congratulations. We don't. I don't <laughs> give a fuck. All right, the bread and butter, as we all know, of any NBA 2K experience is the gameplays. Oh, Moses. Like, this nigga over here speaking facts. I see a lot of y'all on Twitter, you stupid-ass content creators. A lot of y'all fucking idiots. Y'all been saying this shit for years. Bro, it don't matter how much you gloss up shit, dress up shit, it's still gonna be shit, nigga. Gameplay matters most. Y'all niggas was begging for mascots, OD. Niggas brought mascots, nobody using it. No one cares, nigga. Like, that shit don't mean shit, bro. The gameplay is the foundation. You can have whatever little stupid-ass build system you want. It don't matter, bro. The gameplay is what matters, bro. You know, you think a build system is going to make you, like, want to play, like, just so long and so much no oh, i can make this i could spend two hundred dollars and make this and make that and, oh my god ah. i gotta say if you're a content creator you're trying to get bread off niggas you know so you just make limitless builds but bro it's the gameplay that makes you really play that whole man and y'all gotta understand that shit it's the basketball it's why you buy the game uh, and that's something yeah. we take very, very seriously here. We built oh, yeah. um, our entire brand on the back of our basketball game. Mm -hmm. NBA 2K22 takes huge steps to making that experience better than ever. Okay. Uh, with a very um, sharp focus on offense and defense and making those components more skill-based. We're we going to see. He's saying the same shit as Mike Wang. I don't trust him. Nigga. He's trying to wink at us. He's trying to get us, my nigga. Leak! Leak! He trying to get us, my nigga. You know, he trying to he trying to persuade us. You know, these are these are persuasion tactics, my nigga. He trying to wink at us. You know, he's showing us. You see, it's 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 a persuasion. I don't I don't know what to expect, my nigga. I do know what to suspect, but you know, it's 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 not looking too good, man. Like, damn. And less random animation base. We've made in less random animation based. You know how great 2K would be if, if like they really taken these steps. I would, I would, I would, I'd be extremely happy about that. Y'all let me know what if y'all would be <coughs> happy about that too, man. NBA 2K22, both the most accessible and the most enjoyable NBA 2K experience to date. Users are gonna damn the most accessible, most enjoyable NBA 2K to date. Y'all think this gonna be the go? Y'all think it's gonna be better than 16, 14, 15, 17? 
Y'all think this gonna be better? Y'all think this gonna be the best 2K after 17? Huh? What, what y'all think? Y'all think it's gonna be better than the 21s? Let me know. Let, let, let me know your list of uh, part 2Ks down below. I have complete control over layups and dunks and... Complete control over layups and dunks. Layups OP? Leak, leak, leak. Um, dunks. That sounds fun. Have they ever said anything like that? Complete control over layups and dunks? I don't think they have. They probably added some new feature. Man, it's looking like that might be a focus, so contact dunks might still be stupid OP. Maybe we could really go crazy, man. I, I don't know. Y'all let me know off of what he said. I, I don't think I've ever heard, heard anything about that. More control over it. Maybe maybe this could mean that you y'all y'all know them super slow Duncan animations or layup animations that you get that you have no control over and you have to go through the animation and you can't just bail out real quick or do like a always a quick layup. It has it's like animation based based off the angle and whatever animation it wanna give you. You know, it gives you slow ass layups or slow ass dunks maybe there's like a quick way to dunk you know that would be dope y'all let me know if y'all would enjoy that feature dev swan in the comments and those mechanics in, in previous years you would kind of run towards the basket you press you know the shoot button and something would happen <laughs> oh god this <laughs> nigga bro i ain't read this before i not read i ain't watched this before i I uh, listen to this shit, you know, uh, then niggas, uh, man, we gonna see in my predicted swan. On um, this year, you have control over the outcome, the animation. Okay, outcome, and animation. Well, it may sound like <laughs> there is complexity added to it. We gonna see. I, it's really not. It puts the control in your hands. You feel good when you make we it. We gonna you see. You understand when you miss. We, we gonna see, nigga. Because, nigga, I've been missing open layups for years, my boy. No one near me. You know, it's not as bad as it used to be, but it used to be pretty bad, my nigga. You feel me? And Mike Wink said he couldn't fix it. <laughs> How the fuck you can't fix a nigga's missing wide open? <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, and we think our fans are going to love it, and we know they are because they've been asking for it for a long time. Oh, uh, that we have. On the visual side of things, uh, the visuals in the game are crazy this year. Um, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. I seen some screenshots shit looking the same. Hey man, I, I just hope the game plays good, man. I'm trying to go crazy, upload daily for y'all. So man, y'all gotta be in tune, show support to your boy. Have been working relentlessly all through the pandemic to scan uh -huh. as many players as we could. NBA, okay. WNBA, um, generic people for you know the NPCs in our city. <laughs> Damn, they scanning randoms, nigga. NPCs are the future. Remember who told you first. Uh, we're just going to scan crazy. And the results are incredible. You've seen Candace Parker, uh, how good she looks. You've seen Luca. No, uh, she don't look Dirk. good. Like we've, we've had trouble with Dirk for like the last 15 years. Dirk looks like Dirk this year. Uh, Kevin Durant, amazing. And, and as you saw, uh, Rui Hachimura. Man. Looks amazing on our next gen consoles. Uh, visuals is um, a big part of what founded this company. We are visual concepts. Okay. Um, this is something that we are founded upon. Great gameplay, great vision. Show me some new visuals for some fucking mascots, my nigga. Give us skins. Give us skins. I want to be fucking Sasuke, nigga. Naruto, Spider-Man, nigga. I want to be the Hulk. You feel me? And I don't want to have to buy it with with more than what the fuck the game is worth. Why are mascots 300k? We must put an end to this. Ah! And NBA 2K22 delivers on both of those fronts. Okay. And probably the mode that most of you play that you know most everyone plays is our my career mode. It is our narrative driven uh -huh. experience that allows you to uh -huh. you know, effectively go from rags to riches, to go from high school to the NBA. Uh -huh. In NBA 2K22, it is back and it is bigger than ever in many different ways. On the next gen consoles, my career is completely integrated with the city. And what does that mean? Um, I would say in previous years, my career was kind of akin to a movie. 
We already started, heard this. You get a five minute sequence and Trash. You just go play games and you'd eventually get more sequences. Trash. This year, like I said, it's completely integrated. You are going to have an intro. Uh -huh. and then right away, your player is running around the city. He's talking to Asia. But are we playing? Y'all think we're going to be able to play? I'm trying to drop niggas off. I'm, I'm trying to win 10 1v1s and win fucking 100k VC for the day, my boy, or some shit. I don't know. Or a bunch of XP. Something. He's talking to his best friend, coaches. It's very RPG. Matchmaking 1v1s. You know, something. I don't know, man. You like you are experiencing RPG like in the city that you live in. For the viewers out there, y'all gonna watch niggas on stream do this RPG shit. Uh, it's a really cool feeling, and it's a really big evolution for sports video games. Uh, we're definitely the first to do anything, uh, you know, of this stature. Shut uh, up, honestly, nigga. Y'all niggas on the low totem pole of gaming. Stop that cap, nigga. I've played the first couple. Nigga, I'm playing a game that's uh, in beta, split gate, nigga. <laughs> nigga, there's a there's a beta. Like, where the fuck is your beta? Flowers of the mode, over a hundred times, because um, I have to. It's my job. But I actually love it, and I'm gonna go do it after we're done see recording you. this because it's a really good time. People are going to go crazy. Wait, wait, what? And on our current gen consoles, because again, we're really making two games this year. We're making a brand new next gen experience for our next gen consoles and those users. <laughs> And we're, we're doing the see. same thing for current gen. Current gen also has we a fully see. rich narrative um, that people will enjoy in a more. Hey, let me know if you have a PS5 down below, bro. Traditional um, theme. You're on the boat, which we. Or next, or a current gen console, which is the PS5 or the Xbox X. It's not the next gen. It's the current gen, and then last gen is called current gen. If you know what I mean. Talked about earlier. And you're getting the full my career experience in a way that you've been experiencing for many years. So no matter which version of the game you purchase, you're getting a brand new experience that we know okay. you're going to love. Okay. We'll see. I want to tell you about a brand new game mode that will be available at launch. That is my okay. team draft. My team this draft. This is a mode that our fans have been clamoring for. Y'all playing my years. team next year? Let me know. Uh, we finally hit the point this year where we were able to kind of put that all together and deliver it. You this excited? Is a mode where you don't have to have. You know, spent a lot of time building up a crazy deck or a crazy. We gonna see. Of players, you simply go into the mode. Money you hungry up ass and draft the team, so that every time you play it, you're playing with a brand new um, collection of players. Uh, it's a really simple mode. It's really accessible, and there's honestly some of the best prizing in the game this year just by playing my team draft. And we have so okay. much more to share about NBA 2K22, which we will be doing in the coming weeks. Please stay tuned for a lot. Of Wait, my team draft. Do you have to spend money? Let me know, uh, cause if not, man, I'll be on that hoe heavy. Cause I ain't spending no money on this shit. I don't know how y'all niggas do it, bro. Uh, I, 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 unless I was making an adequate, like, crazy amount of money off of it, like, ah, I, I don't know how y'all, like, normal niggas that ain't, that don't be trying to make videos and shit, do that shit. Out of great new features. Okay, man. So we got a new. NBA 2K22 screenshot, I presume. I mean, even though they're not using the hashtag or saying it, maybe this isn't an NBA 2K22 screenshot, but this is what it looked like. Y'all rate this, these graphics down below. They got the little nut, you know, the little tuck. You know, it looked cool. I'm not a graphics nigga, I'm a gameplay nigga, but someone did a comparison, my boy. And this is what it looks like. NBA 2K21 and 22. Um. I guess you could say this is more realistic. This dude has more of a tint to him. Uh, I don't know. Like, I guess. Is this the real 2K21 version? I don't know. Y'all y'all tell me. He don't he don't look like this on 21. Why wouldn't they make this boy white? Like why is he like tan? I'm confused. Maybe I don't see the nigga enough. Okay, we got a little Kyle Laurie. I don't know why, but looking at this shit, when I first seen it, it's like funny. Like he looks like a bobblehead or some shit. Or is it just me, bro? Um, he got some dirt on him and shit. Like what the fuck? But we gonna see the comparison on this hoe too. Like they kind of added a little more sweat. I ain't gonna hold you, my nigga. Um. Little different angle, little more darkness in the eyes, 
a little more darkness on the hair. Um, little. Uh, I don't know, nigga. It's the same shit to me. I made him a little more black. I don't know. Anywho, man, make sure y'all subscribe if you know, man. We posting daily on this host, so make sure y'all show up here tomorrow. Turn on post notifications, like the video. It helps your boy get pushed in the algorithm. And yeah, go watch my last gameplay video, man. It's hilarious. It's edited. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here, here we go again. People talking this for when this hit the fan. Everything I'm that made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome. dome.